A local gymnast competed at the national level, and now they are ready to show off for their next big showcase. Yes, Lori Wallace is live in Elk Grove with all the details. Did you stretch? Are you hitting the balance beam today? In jeans. Seriously, you guys, the strength that these athletes have is incredible. We've been talking Seriously. about that all morning, but the amount of hours they spend in these gyms to get ready, it's no wonder they're as good as they are. And I have Debbie here. Um, I also have Alana and Michelle to talk about this. Now, Michelle is 18, so this is her final competition coming up. When do you leave? Um, next week on Wednesday. Okay, talk a little bit about what this has been like. I know you've spent hours getting ready, and now you're kind of winding down, looking at that next step. So it's basically kind of my first national, so like I'm a little excited about um, the experience and just like being in that environment. And so, then what's next for you? I know you're graduating this year. Yeah, so I was woo -woo. planning on um, trying to get you into the Air Force Academy. Oh, excuse nice. me, the Air Force Academy, that's exciting. And then uh, the younger girls out here have a really fun time watching, you know, the older athletes. So I want to talk a little bit about what it's like being one of the younger ones in the gym and having these girls to look up to. Um, it's super fun, like, watching them do all their skills and stuff, and um, I'm too scared to do them, too. <laughs> hey, you're pretty skilled. I saw you on the beam. You're doing pretty good. How long have you been doing this? Um, I started gymnastics when I was about one and a half, so I've been doing it for a really long time. You could barely walk. <laughs> yeah, we would do those little mommy and me classes. Oh, speaking of the mommy and me classes, the gymnasts in training are right over there. That's where they start out. And Debbie, a lot of times they come at that age and they stay. And they're with you until, like Michelle over here, 18. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we have some of these girls have been with me over 13, 15 years. Yeah, so they're like my own children, like my own kids. And yeah. then when they get to this level and it's their last competition and they're about to graduate high yeah. school, mm -hmm. talk about what that's like here in the gym to see that progression. Um, emotionally, it's hard on the staff because they are part of you. We have great relationships with our kids, um, but oftentimes to watch them move on and be successful, you know that you were part of that. It's, it's, it's endearing to your heart, yeah. And the level of competition, because I know a lot of these athletes, they compete with other kids their age from all over the country. Yep, yep, yep. And to see them go out there and can shine with all the other kids that are in the in the nation, um, it's good to see them have some fun doing that. Yeah. And the younger ones go to competition too. So coming up in the next week, you guys have a really busy schedule. We do. So um, Alana and Al Aliana, she, those two are part of the state team for XL level. So it's the highest level that they can compete at. So kudos to them. And then Kara is leaving tomorrow to go to Western Nationals, and then Michelle is leaving the following week to go to Level 10 Nationals. Well, congratulations to all you ladies. They do such a fantastic job, but they start them really young. And then they have other programs here, too. Uh, just to show you over here on the wall, they have a ninja program. A lot of times, uh, getting the little guys into the gym isn't as easy as getting the girls in. Sometimes um, they are thinking, oh, I don't know if gymnastics is for me, but then they come do the ninja course, and they're like, oh, no, gymnastics is for me. <laughs> so they have a lot of different opportunities in here for kids to get involved, have fun, be active, and get really, really strong. Really so strong. it is really incredible. Congratulations. They've worked so hard uh, to get to where they are. So this competition over the next week or so is going to be huge for all of them. Back over to you guys in the studio. So And so, they're so strong and so graceful. Look at this dismount. Right? Like she's walking on air. Perfection. Love it. Oh. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Lori.